Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Manifusion here, and today we will be testing the defense rating. Right now I have a feeling of what the formula actually is, which is defense plus, or defense divided by two equals damage reduction. So we're going to be testing that out. Apparently there's also a bug reported of the molten armor not working correctly, so we'll see how that goes as well. Alright, so let's see. No armor or any bonuses. We take 8 damage from the slime. We're gonna put on a shackle. Whoops. Okay, put on a shackle. Let's see how much damage we take now. We take 7. Alright, let's see what happens when we have 2 defense. Again, 7. So apparently the number is rounded down, or rounded up rather. So for every plus one defense, you will have, well, every other defense, you'll get minus one damage reduction. Let's try it with three. We should be getting six damage done to us. There we go. And now, so with four, we can assume that we will still be taking six damage. Thus, having odd numbers is the best way to go when determining how much damage you take. Yep, six. So we've established the formula is now two divided by or defense divided by two. So every other. Okay, so what we will now do is test with armor. We're going to be needing more than just slimes for this. So if we could assume that is the correct formula, we should be getting. Let's see, 9 plus 10, 19. Okay, so 28. 28 armor with this. I'm going to go run into a different dungeon and test this out to see if, well, we can be getting more damage done to us. And we're back, ladies and gentlemen. So, we are now going to hell. No armor on at the moment. And we will see how much damage we'll be taking. So that we can better prepare for our math. Let's go, shall we? Alright, we've got this tunnel straight into hell from the surface. And we'll now need to be pretty much shot in the face. Let's see where this goes. As you can see, I'm currently not wearing anything. So that the test will not be screwed due to extenuating circumstances of any kind whatsoever. Now we just have to wait for an imp to spawn. Which hopefully will be sometime soon. There imp. There we go. 30 damage there, and 25 from Bolt. Okay, if the math is correct, I should be taking 19 damage less than 25. Let's try and find a place of reprieve. So that we can actually switch gear and not die. That would be pleasant. Let us go up. Good enough. Oh darn. So as you can see, I'm still taking 11 damage. That would demonstrate that I'm only taking minus 14, which is the armor total without the set bonus. So, I believe we've just mathematically proven that the set bonus of this armor is inaccurate and broken, doesn't work, and that's pretty much all you need to know. And honestly, even with this much armor and this much damage taken, this is still really easy for this part of the game, considering this is end tier. So, if I had any suggestion in saying it, I would say that, well, as the tank class that this is supposed to be, that it should probably do something more tanky, like make the monsters focus on attacking you. While this is pretty much useless in single player, since they already will be doing that, it would support the whole team effort of what multiplayer should be. After all, having assigned roles of different armor classes seems like a good way to go. Anyways, this has been Manifusion. We have discovered that the exact 
science of the defense rating and damage reduction is defense divided by two rounded up. So, I believe that's all the math we need for today. Congratulations, we have made a discovery. Ooh, yay. We have mathematically proven that the armor calculation for this set is off. By the 10 bonus that it's supposed to give as a set. Anyways, this is Manifusion, signing out.